Welcome to the Appliance Show. I am the Appliance Dude here at Curto's in Westchester County, otherwise known as Jonathan. I come to you here on uh, January, I believe it's the 26th, as a blizzard starts to brew outside my windows over here. I'm going to make this short and sweet, and um, I'm going to rock and roll like I normally do, kids. So let's do it. Um, I'm standing here to talk to you about ASCO dishwashers. This is actually going to be a introduction to a vi longer video series. So this will be the intro video, short and sweet, and then we're gonna have about five additional videos or blog posts that come after this, which will talk about some of the key, key feature sets that ASCO dishwashers offer. talk about what is an ASCO. ASCO is a Swedish manufacturer, been in business for five decades, and they make dishwashers and they make laundry. We're going to talk about dishwashers. The dishwashers are part of what I call the European triumvirate. Mila, Bosch, ASCO. ASCO has always been the third wheel, getting kind of short swift in the equation. Never had the acclaim that Bosch and Mila has had. Why? I think it's actually a lot of business reasons, marketing reasons, uh, distribution reasons and um, uh, ownership reasons as well. But we don't need to get into all that mumbo jumbo right now. We wanna talk product. And I have the utmost confidence in this brand as a premium dishwasher, manufacturer, and product. And why? Why do I say that? Because one thing I'll say about ASCO, more so than any other brand that is in this store, okay? When somebody owns an ASCO, they are typically an ASCO customer for life. We have people calling up here who bought ASCO dishwashers in the 1990s. They're gonna replace the dishwasher. I have to have an ASCO. The new dishwashers offer features that you cannot find in any other dishwasher brand, and that includes the other two Europeans. First of all, what is the biggest criticism about the European dishwashers? They don't dry well enough. ASCO has a fan, a turbo fan system, built into their dishwasher so things come out bone dry, even plastic, okay? That is a feature that we are actually going to take that and do a separate video segment just on that, okay? They also have the largest place setting. They actually have 17 place settings in some of their models, which is the largest in the business, okay? They also have the largest loading height, okay, with their XXL series. So you need a big dishwasher, you need to load big plates, you entertain a lot, you wanna do ASCO. Their super cleaning system, they have um, spray arms and jets in areas that you would never even think would be placed inside a dishwasher. So everything is getting scrubbed. There's no debris at the bottom of the dishwasher tub because they have arms that are down there or spray devices that are taken out. So your dishwasher comes out spanking clean. We will do a video segment specifically on the spray action in their dishwashers. And which I should have mentioned first is what they call eight steel. Eight steel means that ASCO uses more stainless steel in their dishwashers than anybody else. You'll notice that when you go to an appliance dealer, you open up a dishwasher, they feel kind of plasticky. Even some of these higher end models, some brands that I won't name, they've got a plastic feel to them. ASCO is all about stainless steel. Steel is better, steel is more hygienic, steel is stronger, okay? One of the reasons why the dishwasher is a little bit pricier, but it's well worth it. The dishwashers are built stronger, their tines, they actually can make their tines wider because of the fact of how much steel they put to actually frame the bottom of the dishwashers. So we are, again, we will do a video segment specifically on their use of steel. Here's actually one of the more important reasons why I feel bullish about ASCO moving forward. Um, because it was actually on its way to becoming a brand. It was gonna go the way of like the Saab automobile, like, you know, cult car, really fervent fan base, but, or ownership base, but just couldn't get out of its way from a business standpoint, and now it's gone. Well, what happened is, is that a year ago, in April, Sub-Zero, Wolf, took over the North American distribution rights to ASCO, okay, for the dishwashers and the laundry. That's a huge, huge, huge development because what that says is Sub-Zero has the highest standards for quality for the products that they create. This is a company that will actually hold products back a year, years, okay, until they have it right. Because they want things, they're not into recalls and stuff like that. They want stuff done the right way. And, okay, by an extension, any other brand that they touch, even on a tangential basis, whether they're distributing the product, whether they're outsourcing something from the other brand, they have to meet Sub-Zero's incredibly high standards of quality as well. 
So for them to take on ASCO's North American distribution rights and position these dishwashers right in the middle. I mean, I have three ASCO dishwashers in the middle of my Sub-Zero Wolf display, which is the largest display. It's bigger than the living kitchen displays in Westchester. And they're right smack in there. So what does that say to you? That Sub-Zero Wolf trust this company you should trust this company i'm actually going to bring one home next week for my own personal use um what happened the interesting development the appliance dudes uh started complaining to me about our dishwasher which is only about four years old four or five years old and she was telling me you know ranting to me the kids you know we have three little ones the, the dishes the forks and nothing's coming out dry it's not coming out clean there's crud in the bottom of the glasses we need a new dishwasher the racks are falling apart and one thing i've learned and gents you smart gents gents out there can appreciate this, I hope, is that when the lady speaks, okay, I listen and I act, all right? I, I've, only, I've been married for eight years and I learned that lesson very, very quickly. When she speaks, when she expresses herself a wish or a desire, the appliance dude acts upon it. So honey, you're getting your new dishwasher this week, all is good. Um, that's about it. We've laid a very, very basic coat of paint on the ASCO dishwasher. We've talked about some little bit about the company, 50 years old, from Sweden. We've talked a little bit about the feature set. We've talked about Sub-Zero Wolf backing them moving forward. We've talked about their cult-like status with their customer base. Now you're going to see a series of videos which is going to talk about the main feature sets that they offer. When all said and done, you will look at all these videos, all these blog posts, you will be an ASCO expert. You will have all the information you need to tell you whether you need to have this dishwasher in your house. Folks, thank you. Be safe in the storm. Yamaste.